It's the fact that you will fall and smash into boulders and die. <laughs> as gruesome as that sounds, that's what makes it so powerful. If you didn't have that, it wouldn't be quite the same. World's hardest big wall free climb. 500 metres high. Are you tough enough? With basically no features. <laughs> it's a line of blackness. You need to be like a gecko to, to climb this thing. If you fall from the last moves, you're going to probably deck. And that's where the climb gets a little more serious. And that, to me, that's what makes it interesting. This is just for fun, really. It's just for fun. The slate is so bizarre. It's like everything is super smooth. You cannot smear it, except for there's like two little edges here. And that's it. That's all you're given, you know? It's just this bloody great feeling of having done something you really, really wanted to do. You've survived it. It's magic, and then within an hour, you're thinking, all right, what's next? Oh, that was absolutely bloody brilliant. Every time I think about it, it just, it just gives you the shivers down your spine, because it's like, that'd be terrifying. Fuck! 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 I don't think I'd want to do that every day. <laughs> if you come off that roof high up, you're going to be in pretty damn bad. <laughs> Yeah, I think I'm pretty close to my absolute limit of what I'm capable of and my yeah, like actual physical limit. No one else could do that. I don't know any other climber that would that would do that.